here just for a short message to wish all Africans well and all who are associated with Africa very well. I came here to a symposium organized by the lady here, Madame Sylvanus, Sylvania, and we, we've done all that we have to do yesterday. But today, Africa Day, is supposed to be the day for all Africa. So I just want to wish everybody a happy Africa Day while saying that for the next time, please, even as we organize the various, you know, um, exhibitions, let us also hear some music from the various African countries. We must hear music from Madagascar, from Morocco, from Senegal, of course Ghana, because I'm from Ghana, Togo, Benin, from Kenya. Let's hear the music from all these places so that we can truly feel that it is Africa Day and we are here for that. Number two, I want to wish all of us the best, but for those of you living here in Germany, I think that when we leave the continent and we come here, there are certain ethics that the Germans have that we must adopt and adapt to. We must adopt the ethics that the Germans have because if we in Africa, we on the continent of Africa with 54 countries were practicing a bit of the ethics of the Germans, trust me, you will not even be here. You will be at home. So please, let us live by the yardstick that we see here and pass some to us at home so that we as a huge continent with 54 countries in there can actually always say that we are learning something from you, those of you who have left, those of you in the diaspora. Let us learn something from you. I am a politician, but I'm also a social worker. I work with women and I work with children. I work with the youth. And what do I tell them? I tell the women, everybody must have a job. You must have something that you are doing so that it will earn you an income. Whether you are married or single, it's irrelevant. You should always have something that you are doing. And then for the young people, I tell them, you must always have a skill. You must have a skill. If you have reached the level of a university and you don't have a skill, you did history and you don't have a job, go and learn something on entrepreneurship. Go and learn a skill so that you can actually get a job. You know, so these are things that I think you can pass on to us as a people, as a continent, and we will learn this from you. Because I don't think that there's anybody here in Germany who can be eating three square meals without working. You gotta work. And once you gotta work, you must know that you're gonna be paid. And so we want to take some of this eth these ethics back. Time, sight is uh, what? Sight is girls, no? Nah? Time is money. So we must make sure that every little time that we get, we use it very well, we use it profitably. I um, can only wish you well, and also uh, tell our chiefs over there that I'm sorry I didn't tell you I'm coming to speak, because I said I wasn't going to say anything. But this is just a goodwill message solidarity message to our brothers and sisters here, our mothers here, our children here, our grandchildren here, so that they live a life that will make them into better persons than who they were when they were leaving the continent of Africa. Thank you very much and God bless you. Und Geld verdienen hat, sagt sie zu den Kindern. Und sie sagt dann, Zeit ist Geld. Sogar auf Deutsch sagt sie das. Und sagt dann in Englisch, Time is Money. Also müssen wir unsere Zeit gut einsetzen können, damit wir das irgendwie, äh, was Gutes draus machen können. Und Mark dann zum Schluss sagt sie, 
Kinder sind sehr wichtig. Und guckt drüben und sagt, wir haben eine königliche Delegation da sitzen. Die hat eigentlich gesagt, sie wird heute keine Rede halten, aber wollte so, so herzlich von den anderen auch gebeten und hat gerne gemacht, dass die euch dann begrüßt vom ganzen Herzen und sagt zu den Kindern, ihr sollt auch mal besser lernen und zu den Eltern und die Familien, weil nur, wenn man gut arbeitet, kann man üben, die Zugänge üben und besser werden und natürlich von den Deutschen lernen. Dankeschön. Thank <laughs> you. 